Hey everyone, let's dive into the world of homemade yogurt. I'm super excited to share this with you because, let's face it, who doesn't love a bowl of creamy delicious yogurt? And making it at home? It just takes it to a whole new level of freshness. First things first, you'll need just two simple ingredients, milk and a bit of yogurt with live cultures. That's right, just two. Now you might wonder, why bother making yogurt at home? Well, not only does it save you money in the long run, but you also get to control what goes into it. No additives, no preservatives, just pure creamy goodness. Step one, heat your milk. Pour about a liter of milk into a saucepan and heat it until it's just about to boil, but don't let it boil over. This step is crucial because it helps to kill any unwanted bacteria and prepares the milk to host the good bacteria from the yogurt starter. Once your milk is heated, let it cool down to lukewarm, about 110 degrees Fahrenheit. This is the perfect temperature for the cultures to do their job. Next, you'll add about two tablespoons of your store-bought yogurt directly into the warm milk. Make sure it contains live active cultures, as this is what turns your milk into yogurt. Stir it gently to distribute the yogurt evenly. Now, the waiting game begins. Cover your saucepan with a lid or a towel and place it in a warm area. This could be in your oven with the light on. Make sure it's off though, or any other spot that maintains a warm environment. The ideal temperature to culture yogurt is around 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Let it sit for about six to 10 hours. The longer it sits, the tangier it will be. After the wait, check if the yogurt has set. It should be thick and tangy. If it's to your liking, refrigerate it to stop the fermentation process. And voila, you've just made your own homemade yogurt. Creamy, healthy, and absolutely delicious. You can now enjoy it plain or toss in some fruits, honey, or nuts for extra flavor. There you have it, folks. Simple, right? Making yogurt at home is not only fun, but also a great way to treat yourself to something healthy. Give it a try and let me know how it turns out. Happy cooking!